artists have been creating masterpieces on guitars for centuries, perhaps millennia. But at a music shop in Maryland, artists are creating masterpieces not with, but literally on guitars. These are the entries in a guitar decorating contest. The idea came to the store's owner, Tony Litz, after he bought this guitar at an auction. He calls it the Beatles guitar. Because that's what it's got a bunch of Beatles on it and thought, on the drive home, thought let's have a guitar decorating contest. Sisters Laney and Ann Selby were among the customers who tried making art rather than music with one of the donated guitars. I started with the hands and the, um, with the guitar pick. Well, my mom, she would do like, like she would draw like the puzzle pieces and then I'd like color them in. And like we would glue like the paper on. So we just did like the, out, the outline of everything. Decorating a guitar was also a collaborative effort for the Williams family. Jim and Lori and their daughters, Christina and Michelle. We basically photoshopped a bunch of Jimi Hendrix photos and kind of, kind of made a montage on there and put them on there. It looks pretty cool. Edwin Zelaya called his piece Star Guitar. It is inspired by Vincent van Gogh, and his artwork is like uh, very special to me. Van Gogh's influence on pop music and on the British TV series Doctor Who led to this design by Tammy McLaren. I wanted to think of something that would go on the guitar, and then I thought about Don McLean's um, Starry Starry Night song. I did the front first, and then I did an exploding TARDIS from a Van Gogh episode, and then I tied it in with the words. Jennifer Yoon created steampunk rock out of a donated broken guitar. So I didn't want to destroy an actual guitar, but since it was already broken, well. Then I just started tinkering around with different things, um, an old brass socket, a reproduction old light bulb, mattress spring, some gauges that are non-functional. Customers had 10 days to judge the entries, and when the votes were counted, the winner was this guitar by 15-year-old Carla Araneda. First I used a stain, a white stain for like the whole front a stain like paint okay. for the like whole front part and then for the black drawings um, I use acrylic. And lots and lots of people have seen it. So while not everyone can play a masterpiece on the guitar, the contestants at least made a guitar their own special masterpiece and that's beautiful music to Tony Litz's ears. For writer Fiza El Masri, I'm Faith Lapidus, VOA News.